hey guys welcome back to my channel i want to share my february bullet journal flip through yes i changed up the cover of my notebook i covered it with some wrapping paper and i think it looks so much better than leaving it plain here's my cover page i have a quote on the left and the month header on the right i dedicate this month to self-care and self-love i am also trying to do more lettering there's just going to be a lot of hearts and a lot of quotes in this setup. For my monthly, I stuck to my usual greed. I have a clever quote on the left and the, and the month header with some hearts at the top and bottom of it. Then I have split the table into two just to have clear dimensions for my calendar. I like it because it is functional and quite simple. For my habit track, I decided to continue using the one I did for my January setup. If you look carefully, the lines are not running straight between the two pages, so I thought that setup worked best. And for my habits, I am still cleaning them up and added some more to try out as part of self-care. My mood tracker is quite simple, I had for every day and date. For the next page, I have a quote and my gratitude log. I love the hat surrounding and bordering the page. It looks really nice to me. Yeah. The next page, there is a quote too, and I had a lot of fun making this one, followed by my brain dump, and I love the border and the cluster of hats at the corners. I totally love how it turned out. Then my daily and weekly task pages follow, always keeping me up to my tasks. For the dailies, I have some chores with a mini calendar that only has the first and last dates on it. I probably should have added another task here, but I preferred having a quote instead. And I think it is really beautiful. For the weekly task, I just lay down the tasks I want to handle once a week on specific days and I check the dates and put all this there for ease of tracking. Then I have my meal plan page and I thought this quote is really clever and I'm all about weighty quotes and sayings. Then a lovely quote just there just as a reminder for myself and you my viewer. Finally I have my first week of February set up here. We are at, we are at week 6. Just in case you're wondering where my first and second days are, they are on the last weekly spread of my January setup and I post this over at my Instagram account. I always change up my weeklies and that's the freedom I enjoy in the bullet journal. I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know. I'll see you next time. Bye.